Kia ora, I'm James. I'm a lecturer in the Department of Mechanical Engineering here at the University of Canterbury, and I'm an MB Science Fatinga Fellow. My research, or my interest, is in fluid mechanics. From my PhD, I wanted to stay in uh, academia. I enjoyed the research uh, environment and the freedom to sort of uh, pick out and target things of interest to me. And I stayed in the, the field of fluid mechanics, looking at lava flow rheology, which is important for volcanic eruptions to be able to determine and forecast how quickly these lava flows will disseminate from the volcano. From there, I applied for the uh, Vitingo Fellowship. So this was on a project of looking at the blood clotting. And it has a, an interesting connection to my work during my PhD. My PhD, I have worked on silica scaling and uh, geothermal heat exchanges. So this is pipe flow. Our blood vessels are also uh, nice pipes. And we have this plaque that builds up over time. And this is quite analogous to our silica scaling and geothermal. After finishing my PhD, I was looking at next steps and opportunities. So we have very, very few postdoctoral positions uh, in New Zealand. So I applied to the Rutherford Foundation uh, applied to the Marsden Fast Start. So these were unsuccessful, uh, as often is the case, uh, but we kept trying. Uh, fortunately, I was awarded this fellowship uh, and that enabled me to, to plan for a two-year solid research project. And this has enabled me to make new connections with uh, other organisations and funding bodies within New Zealand. So there's a new centre of research excellence, uh, Healthy Hearts for Aotearoa New Zealand. So their focus is on cardiovascular diseases, particularly within the, the Māori and Pacific Islands population. By engaging and collaborating with this group, uh, I'm able to form uh, networks and links with the community and clinicians to hopefully ensure that my more theoretical and modelling analysis can be applied and connected to uh, real clinical outputs and essentially, uh, at the end of the day, save lives.